Welcome back to Talent Watch, where I spotlight upcoming talent in front of and behind the camera set to make it big this year. Now, just like when I spotlighted Matthew McConaughey, today's pick is another actor who you might think already had their shot, Eva Green. This French actress made quite a splash back in 2003 with her racy debut role opposite Michael Pitt in Bernardo Bertolucci's The Dreamers. And when the director of The Last Tango in Paris sings your praises, well, the James Bond franchise comes a-calling. Green was cast in the role that Angelina Jolie turned down, that of the very first Bond girl, Vesper Lind. But despite her stellar turn opposite Daniel Craig, Bond girls are as disposable to fans as they are 007. A series of not particularly noteworthy roles followed, with Green hitting something of a rock bottom with the TV series Camelot, where she played the villainous Morgan Le Fay. It wasn't Game of Thrones. Then last year, things seemed to be looking up when Green landed the villain role in Dark Shadows opposite Johnny Depp, yet sunk once more when the film fizzled at the box office with critics and with audiences. But while Green's career has been in limbo since Casino Royale, she might finally see it cemented in 2013. First, this August, she'll play the female lead, a commander in the Persian army in 300 Rise of an Empire, the sequel to the hit 2007 film that launched not only Gerard Butler's career, but significantly helped Lena Headey as well. Hetty actually has a lot of similarities with Green, and 300 started her on a path that ultimately led to her coveted role on Game of Thrones. But Green might be able to do even better, as this year she'll also star in yet another much-anticipated sequel, Sin City, A Dame to Kill For. And interestingly, she is once more taking on a role Angelina Jolie turned down, that of femme fatale Ava Lord. So do you think this is Eva Green's year, or would you have preferred to see Angelina Jolie in these roles after all? And do you think Green can surpass Lena Headey's career, who, by the way, also co-stars in 300 Rise of an Empire? Or is there some kind of European model actress glass ceiling? Write your thoughts down below. I'm Grace Randolph, and I hope you'll check out the rest of BTT's Talent Watch series.